Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, you're very welcome. For those that are returning subscribers, thank you very, very much. If you are new to my channel, I post my videos on Thursdays and Sundays at 6.30pm. So consider pressing that subscribe button if you enjoy this type of content and also press the bell button so you don't miss out any of my new videos. In today's video, we're going to talk about um, something I saw on Instagram that kind of ignited my thoughts a bit and yeah i hope you guys enjoy this video so i was just scrolling on instagram as you do and i came across this quote or like a series of quotes should i say and it talked about how the ship doesn't sink because of the water around it but it sinks because of the water that gets inside it. I'm probably misquoting this, but the concept is still the same. And it just made me think like, like how this also links with life in general. You can be exposed to something and it have no effect on you whatsoever. The moment you internalize it or the moment or even if someone can say something that is not offensive but the moment you take it personally it becomes offensive and that's like the same with just even being in a negative environment you can be in a negative environment and be and still be a very positive person but the moment you let that negativity get to you or that negativity affects you and you internalize it and it becomes your problem it becomes a whole different story it just got me thinking about how you also have to take that into account when it comes to like negative opinions that people may have people can say whatever they want and that can just be the sea around you and the water is actually needed for the ship to do what it's meant to do. The water is a very necessary and important part of that function for that ship because if the water is not there, that ship is not going anywhere. Use that negativity as a fuel for you to achieve what you want or for you to keep going towards that dream or for you to prove to yourself that no, although you're telling me I can't do this and I can't do do that me myself i know i can and prove it to yourself and use their negativity as a fuel to keep you going for the water to be able to get into that ship there has to be a crack there has to be the weak link in that ship that then allows the water to then get in but the defense mechanism that's on that ship has to be broken down for that water to get in which brings me to the next point. Make sure that you are mentally equipped and mentally strong. You need to have thick skin if you want to do anything with impact in the world because people are always gonna come after you. People are always gonna have something to say. People are always going to try and knock you down. And sometimes it comes from a place of how dare you go after your dream when I can't get enough courage for me to follow my dream. So it's not even necessarily that they think your idea is bad, but it's how dare you go after your dream while I'm stuck in the same place. So they become an enemy not from a place of you are a competitor or from a place of what you're doing is not good, but from a place of insecurity. You could be someone that they, de they deem as someone who is lower than them and they cannot bring themselves to see you elevate yourself past maybe what they are although in life you're not even meant to be comparing yourself to other people your only competitor is you but some people are not quite mentally there to realize that your only competition is yourself so it's like how dare you someone i deem as my inferior want to be above me. you need to have thick skin you need to make sure that you are mentally conditioning yourself for success mentally conditioning yourself to not to listen to people's opinions and not to let people get to you too much and just learning to let things go like most of the things that people say to you are not personal and so yeah once you start letting what people other people are saying or once you start listening to these negative voices to these negative opinions 
then that's where the issue comes you start doubting yourself you start doubting your brand your product whether you know your services are good enough it's only then when you when you allow your defense mechanism to break down or when you allow yourself to internalize these issues that they actually become an issue the ship only sinks because of the water that gets into it not the water that's around it so you will only start doubting yourself once you let these negative opinions internalize and get into your subconscious and you start pondering over these things and self-doubt will keep increasing because you keep wondering whether i am good enough whether i can do it whether it's for me whether you know people are going to react well to it there is always something for somebody someone will love your product it's just don't, don't let don't let other people's opinions and your own negative opinions be the thing that stops you from going after your goals use that constructive criticism as a way to grow and to to keep pushing yourself because all this negative energy you think people can, are giving you that is still energy and you can transform you can change that energy into something that is more useful rather than manifesting into self-doubt and things like that but yeah that's my um video for today guys i hope it's provided some sort of insight and yeah i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys